Well, howdy, folks. How are you doing? I know you may be wondering, what am I doing with this gigantic chunk of meat in my hand? Don't you worry. I'm going to show you what I'm doing with it. We're going to make the best sloppy joes known to man. I ain't talking none of that stuff you pour out of a can already pre-made sloppy joe juice stuff. No siree. I'm talking homemade, redneck style sloppy joes, cuz. And what we're going to start out with is three pounds of 80-20 uh, beef right here. And, uh... If y'all use that other stuff that you just pour on everything, I'm gonna go ahead and let you know, nobody likes it. You better quit doing it. Let's brown this up. Alrighty, folks, whenever you're browning your meat right chunder, you wanna get you some onion, chop it up, or do like I did. I'm lazy, I wanna head bought it already chopped up. Get you some good sweet onions right there. Pull that whole dude in yonder, which I guess would be around, I don't know, maybe one small onion. It really don't matter. Uh, this ain't science, it's just food, okay? So what we got now, we're going to put that in there, I'm going to finish browning all the meat up. And uh, we're going to keep putting goodies in here, by God, I guarantee you, you and everybody else that tries this, is going to love it, by God, I promise you. While we're browning her, we can go ahead and put our seasoning in yonder, starting it off with some Tony Sassery's right there, like always. I believe in it religiously around here, anything I'm cooking, Tony's is going on it nine times out of ten. Then you take and get you a little bit of this uh, this ground cinnamon right here. It don't take too awfully much. Just uh, I don't know, maybe like a half a teaspoon or so. Ah, uh, yeah, get that in there. Boy, it's gonna make it good. I tell, I tell you what. And then come over here, get you a little bit of that black pepper right yonder. Okay, like that. I don't know about the same thing. Maybe put you. Uh, I'd probably put a little bit more than a teaspoon in it. Maybe he'd go on. Put around a tablespoon. Everybody likes black pepper. And then we got your little garlic powder right here, okay? Go ahead and pour your little garlic powder in there. And uh, I don't know, maybe a teaspoon or so of that. And then we got you your salt here. About, I don't know, maybe about a teaspoon or so of that. Now, let's go ahead and see how she's looking. Look at that. Just that alone, folks, the onions and all the seasoning in it with all that meat cooking in there, it makes the entire house smell wonderful. Let me get this finished up and I'll show you what else to do next. I love you. Alrighty, folks, this here's where things start getting good, okay? This here's what separates the men from the boys. This is what tells you this ain't your mama's sloppy gel you used to eat. Look what we got right here. Look at that. I got a whole pack of bacon I cut up real fine. And I'm going to pour that. Right on in there, right on in top of all that ground beef, son. I'm going to let all that cook up. Mm. You ain't never in your life, never had a sloppy joe this good. Son, would you look at that? Look at all that, that beef and bacon in there. She's cooking up just right. Look, that's good. All right, now it's time to make her a little better. And uh, you can do whatever you want. I like mine a little spicy. So I got the hot Rotel diced up tomatoes with uh, the habaneros in there. I'm gonna put two cans in her, just like so. Oh, 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 oh yeah, be sure to get it all, cause it's all good, okay? It's real good. Let me stir that bad boy up like so. My hand, yeah. All right, we got our beef, we got our bacon, we got our onions, we got our rotel. Y'all hang with me, okay, it's getting better. Now, we're gonna put about, I don't know, about uh, technically that much mustard in it, all right? Take a gander at her, uh, that much. And then, you take whatever barbecue sauce you like, I like Sweet Baby Ray's, that's what we eat around here. And put about, I don't know, I'm going to probably put, I'd say at least, I'd say at least half that bottle in yonder. Look like at that. Look at there. We got the Sweet Baby Ray's, we got the mustard, we got the rotel, we got the onion. We got the beef, we got the bacon. I'm gonna mix all that up and then we'll be back. There's even more, okay? 
Howdy folks, and even give her just a little bit more kick. I got this uh, bourbon barrel aged hot hive spicy honey from uh, Fuego there. Look at that. I can't even begin to tell you how wonderful that stuff tastes right there. So I can't imagine. It's the first time I've ever put it in here. I usually just put a little hot sauce. But I guarantee you that's going to kick it up and make it a little sweet. It's going to be good. All right, so now last and most certainly not least, go ahead and pour your whole little bag of your cheddar cheese in yonder, and then turn the fire off, and then mix that dude up real good like so. Oh, my goodness. Y'all look at this. Look at that. Just want to mix that cheese up real good and everything like so. Man. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, mm-hmm, goodness gracious, oh god, that's going to be good right there. Now I got that done, I'm going to take my lid, set her on her, push her off the hot burner, and just let her set there for, I don't know, 10-15 minutes, let everything soak up, and uh, we're going to throw it on some of these sesame seed jumbo buns here. You can do whatever bread you like. I like big, uh, I like big sloppy joes, so I get the big jumbo buns with the sesame seed. You can do whatever, and uh, I'll show you in just a minute, boys and girls. Howdy, folks. Here we are. The moment of glory. Woo! All the cooking's done. We've been patiently waiting. Slap that on yonder. I like mine extra sloppy. Don't worry about getting her on the sides. It's perfectly fine with me. Let's see here. Hold on before I cover up. Check that out, y'all. Mmm. Alrighty, boys and girls. The time is now. Check this dude out. Oh, my goodness. <coughs> Man. That uh, that turned out. That's the best it's ever turned out. I put that spicy honey in there. Good God, I'm telling y'all. Y'all do this, you will never, never, never want to eat a regular or sloppy Joe ever again. It's good, it's cheap, and everybody enjoys it. Y'all be cool, stay classy. I love you. Enjoy your sloppy Joes, baby.